Congratulations to the class of 2023. It's an honor to share this special occasion with our graduates and their families as we celebrate the educational accomplishments of the graduating class. Our graduates have certainly shown us what it means to remain committed to a goal with perseverance, dedication, and hard work. Their journey through Newport News Public Schools has included rigorous coursework, high expectations, and service to the community. Under the guidance of our great teachers and staff, our students have mastered academic requirements, competed in sports and academic competitions, served their schools and communities, and developed the skills necessary to be productive citizens. Each day, our schools focus on one mission, ensuring that all students graduate college, career, and citizen ready. Recognized as an innovative school district, Newport News Public Schools provides a curriculum that builds the skills, knowledge, and expertise that students need for 21st century success. But it didn't just happen with desire alone. It took studying, perseverance, sacrifice and extra effort, you stayed focused, you kept your eye on the prize, and you followed through. And during this time, Newport News Public Schools continued to offer opportunities to prepare all students for future success. With advanced placement courses, dual enrollment, early college, career and technical education courses, and youth development opportunities, the class of 2023 has the knowledge and skills to graduate college, career, and citizen ready. And Heritage's class of 2023 has their own special achievements to be proud of. Heritage's graduating class earned academic excellence with 78 seniors graduating with honors, while 47 graduates received the President's Award for Educational Excellence with a 3.5 GPA or higher. 15 senior canes were enrolled in the early college program through the Virginia Peninsula Community College and five seniors participated in the Community Captains Program at Christopher Newport University. Heritage boasts an excellent athletics program with multiple state champions in track and all state recognition in basketball and volleyball. Heritage's Navy JROTC drone team earned top finishes at numerous drone competitions. Heritage students gained valuable career experience and IT repair certifications by restoring 85 surplus computers for local students through the Virginia Star Program. Heritage's music program earned the highest award in the Commonwealth, receiving the Virginia Music Educators Association Blue Ribbon Award for superior ratings in band, orchestra, and choral performance. What I ask of you is to continue to lead by example while providing direction, purpose, and motivation, and not one at the expense of the other. As you head into life's next chapter, we are all excited to see how you take these skills, interests, gifts, and talents to the next level. You have a strong foundation on which to build a life of purpose, character, and integrity. Congratulations on your achievement and best wishes for a prosperous future. We're extremely proud that Newport News Public Schools has opened doors for thousands of students. Now, we encourage the class of 2023 to move forward and step into their future. Thank you, best wishes, and enjoy the ceremony.
I am Dr. Erling M. Hunter. Good morning. I am Dr. Erling M. Hunter, and I remain excited every day to be the principal of Heritage High School. On behalf of our faculty, staff, and students, I would like to welcome you to the commencement exercises for the graduating class of 2023. This morning is a momentous occasion in our students' lives, and we ask that you help give this day the respect and dignity it deserves. At this time, I ask that you please stand and gentlemen, remove your hats as the Heritage High School NJROTC honors our nation with presentation of colors. Please remain standing as the Heritage High School Blue Ribbon award-winning music department performs the national anthem and alma mater. The band is under the direction of Mr. Jameer Brown and chorus under the direction of Mrs. Arcelia Simmons. Presentation of colors. The Heritage High School Navy Junior Reserve Officer Training Corps is under the direction of Naval Science Instructors, Senior Chief Samson Edmonds and Lieutenant Commander Eric Tyson. The color guard for today's commencement ceremony are Cadet Lieutenant Jalen Davis carrying the national flag, Cadet Lieutenant Commander Madison Davis carrying the state flag, Cadet Lieutenant Junior Grade Tyree Finney carrying the port rifle, and Cadet Ensign Amaya Valentine carrying the starboard rifle.
You may be seated. Many dedicated school division officials have provided support necessary to bring us to today's graduation ceremony, including the interim superintendent and the school board. We are honored to have many of these individuals present today. Please join me in recognizing the interim superintendent, Dr. Michelle Mitchell. Dr. Mitchell has served as a teacher, assistant principal, principal, executive director, and interim chief academic officer. Her tenure with Newport News Public Schools spans nearly 28 years. Also joining us today are several members of the school board and the school district administrative team. School board chair, Ms. Lisa Searles Law. Ms. Searles Law is a science education administrator at Jefferson Lab. She is a member of several professional and community organizations and is a strong proponent of STEM education and teacher professional development. Mrs. Searles Law was first elected to the school board in 2018. School board vice chair, Dr. Terry Best. Dr. Best is a retired Newport News Public School administrator and a graduate of Newport News Public Schools. She is actively involved in many community activities and is an advocate of youth development. She was first elected to the school board in 2018. School board member, Ms. Maritza Alger. Ms. Alger retired from public education after 32 years of service as a teacher, specialist, assistant principal, and principal. She is a member of numerous professional and community organizations. Ms. Alger was appointed to the school board in February 2023. School board member, Mr. Douglas Brown. <laughs> Mr. Brown is a director of data science for a software company. As a product of public schools and a former educator, he believes in the power of public education to drive economic growth locally and generationally. He has served on the school board since 2014. School board member, Mr. Marvin Harris. Mr. Harris is a training executive for the Department of Defense with 39 years of continuous service to our nation. He is a strong advocate of early childhood education. He has served on the school board since 2016. Also with us this morning, Chief Operations Officer Rusty Fairheart. Also present today, from the City of Newport News City Council, Vice Mayor Curtis Bethany. Our dedicated legislators, State Senator Dr. Mamie Locke. Newport News Police Chief Steve Drew. Lieutenant Morgan and Captain Funyak. It is my pleasure to introduce your Heritage High School Senior Class President, Miss Niasia Jackson. <laughs> Miss Jackson has been a member of the Legacy Jazz Choir for the past four years, a member of the Lady Canes field hockey team, 
and served on the Mayor's Youth Commission. Niasia will be furthering her education on a full scholarship at Morgan State University, where she will major in biology. Ladies and gentlemen, Miss Niasia Jackson. Good morning, students and esteemed guests. My name is Niasia Jackson, and I am the proud senior class president of the class of 2023. I am delighted to speak for you all this morning. First, I would like to thank my friends and family for their extra push and support, which has gotten me to the place I am today. Many of us have been through challenging situations throughout the last four years, but that is not our story. Still, we rise. I am overjoyed to see every single one of you in front of me today. The class of 2023 is a family. Our class has built a tight-knit community that I've never seen or experienced in a school before. Many of us have spent countless hours after school, whether it be for sports, tutoring, or simply mentoring. We have had to lean on each other and build ourselves up from within. I can confidently say our perseverance is much stronger than our struggle. I believe that our class as a whole will continue to use their strong spirit to blossom into the world. Please take it from me when I say that you can accomplish your goals with a little bit of hard work and dedication. In the words of Maya Angelou, do the best you can until you know better. And then when you know better, do better. My peers, we know life will have obstacles. All you have to do is cartwheel through them, like Dr. Hunter, <laughs> or roll over them like barbecue in that cart he loves. <laughs> we have been through so much adversity, and we have come out on the other side with our heads held high. Either way, some more words from Maya Angelou that perfectly embody the hurricane spirit. Now you understand just why my head is not bowed. Remember to look up to the sky and remember who you are. Why be humble when you are a hurricane? We will now have another musical selection from the Heritage High School Choir. For those who try, just dream to fly as eagles fly across the sky. I know.
Heritage High School has a legacy of valedictorians and salutatorians that are active in our school and local community. This year is no exception. It is my pleasure to invite our class of 2023 salutatorian, Mr. Samuel Ayala Sanchez, to the podium to give his salutatorian address. Samuel was an active leader in high school while also thriving academically as a member of the Future Business Leaders of America, Key Club, and a leadership ambassador. He was also a player on our boys' soccer team. Samuel will be furthering his education at Old Dominion University, where he will major in psychology. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Samuel Ayala Sanchez. Good morning. My name is Samuel Ayala Sanchez, and I am extremely grateful for the opportunity to speak before you today. We've come exceedingly far and have even further to venture. Although this time period in life may be a whirlwind of past memories as well as future goals, I want all of you to be able to take the time and cherish the gray area that we call the present. This is something that's often taken for granted and therefore is something that we allow to pass us by so very frequently. The present may be something dissimilar for each of you, but we are still existing in the same moment, in the same place, and with the same people. I encourage you to simply look around you today and remember the faces of the classmates that experience this phenomenal second, minute, and hour that you are experiencing as well. You fought the battles it took to earn this reality, and no one is prouder of you than your peers, family, and all of the 5,800 faculty and staff. All of those early mornings and long school days questioning whether it would be worth it in the end brought you to this point. The diplomas you all will take home today were earned by your hard work and dedication throughout high school. So take a deep breath and allow yourself to just enjoy the freedom that you have for the first time in four years. Because soon you will start a new, even longer journey. Right here, right now, you are finally able to do nothing but celebrate your successes. Put aside the struggles of the past, the uncertainty of the future, and appreciate how much you've accomplished by simply being here today. Friends, family, I wanna thank all of you for being present today for your graduates. For me, I am especially thankful for the faith and trust my parents gave to me to do the right thing. Without our parents' support, things would have been so much more difficult and we respect and value you, even though sometimes it may be hard to show it. Graduates, soak all of this in. You have your closest teachers, friends, and family members all here to watch you walk across this stage and receive this diploma, proving you've made it. In this present moment, you have shown that you have what it takes to prosper. You've done so much and have so much more in store for yourself. May you have all the happiness and good fortune in the world, for each of you is capable of shaping yourself into someone astonishing. Thank you. It is my pleasure to invite our class of 2023 valedictorian, Mr. Patrick T. Ricks, to the podium to give his valedictorian address. Mr. Ricks has been dedicated to his academic studies as shown by his 4.35 GPA. He is involved in several organizations, including serving as the captain of the basketball team, Spark Youth Development intern, and member of Emerging Leaders. In addition, he participated in the early college program. Patrick will be attending Virginia State University and plans to major in finance. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Patrick Ricks. Good morning, faculty, staff, family, friends, coaches, mom, dad, and the class of 2023. 
I remember back when I was in eighth grade turning into 5800 Marshall Avenue on my way to practice and seeing the marquee with the names of the valedictorian and salutatorian on it. My dad turned to me and asked, is that gonna be you? I told him, yeah, that's gonna be me. <laughs> then he let me know that I have to give a speech at graduation and I said, "Never mind. I don't wanna be up there no more. <laughs> but now, four years later, I am proud to stand before you all today as valedictorian of the class of 2023 at Heritage High School. Throughout elementary, middle, and high school, we have all been asked the same questions. What do you want to be when you grow up? And where do you see yourself in 10 years? I'm sure that we all picture ourselves with a high paying job, a nice house, a nice car, a beautiful spouse, and maybe some children. I know that this is the life that I want for myself, but the reality is that it's hard to achieve all those things. We have to go through the long journey of college and or work our way up through the workforce. We have to go through many long nights and early mornings to reach our goals. Nothing in life will be given or handed to us. We have to go through the struggle of the unknown as we have throughout our lives already. With that being said, I believe that each and every one of us are capable of achieving the goals that we want for ourselves because we are resilient. The class of 2023 at Heritage High School is resilient. We have endured many hardships, whether it be at school or home. We still woke up every morning and worked hard to overcome our struggles. This resilience has united us here today and has allowed us to earn the right to put on these caps and gowns, sit in these chairs, and walk across this stage. Some of us have known one another since elementary school, some since middle school, some have met here at Heritage, and some of you have never met at all. But now, we will all venture into our own lanes and continue on our way to our high paying jobs, nice houses, nice cars, beautiful spouses, and maybe some children. <laughs> Thank you. At this time, Ms. Jackson, Mr. Ayala Sanchez, and Mr. Ricks, you may join your class. This morning, the class of 2023 leaves Heritage High School. But before they move on, their legacy deserves recognition. Their efforts and persistence have continued the hurricane tradition, which demands the involvement of students in their school and community, while also honoring the unique talents of all students. Please allow me to share a few of their many accomplishments. 26% of the graduates earned a grade point average of 3.0 or higher for their four years in high school. 42% of the seniors maintained a GPA of at least 2.0, and this class has an average of 2.4. 47 seniors earned the Presidential Award for Academic Excellence, earning at least a 3.5 GPA. 13 seniors maintained a 4.0 or higher, and 30. African-American males were selected as 200-plus male scholars for earning a GPA of 3.0 or higher. The class of 23 has earned 380 industry certifications, preparing them to thrive in a world of ever-changing technologies. Our graduating hurricanes have been busy serving their community and school. 32% participated in school activity and 93 students earned a university or magnet, a university magnet or governor STEM seal for dedication to pursuing academic rigorous courses. 30% participated in athletics and four of our top 10 for the class of 23 are student athletes. 51 seniors held a job while also attending high school. The class of 2023 has received over $12.6 million in scholarship offers for continued education. 
$12,613,265 to be exact. And finally, after graduation, the Heritage High School class of 23 has important plans for the future. 32 plan to immediately apply the knowledge they have gained by entering the workforce or technical fields. 13 will serve our great nation in the military, and 146 will further their academic growth by attending a two- or four-year college or university. Families and guests, please join me in applauding the outstanding achievement, service, and future of our graduates. Greetings, 5,800 family. There are few things that bring me more pride than having the opportunity to stand before you as the principal of the infamous, the resilient, the prestigious, the electrifying, the dedicated, the often imitated but never duplicated Heritage High School Hurricanes. You know the hashtag, you know the vibes, and you know the swagger. It's big heritage, and for us, it's always the Canes. From the stylings of the incomparable Marching Storm, to the elite Stomp and Shake Champion Cheer Squad, to the two-time, wait a minute, three-time Girls State Champion Track and Field Team, home of the Citywide High School Teacher of the Year, and the list of accolades grows daily. No one, and I mean absolutely no one, does it like the 5800 family. See, we don't just show up, but we also show out. So every year, this is the struggle trying to come up with the right combination of words to convey the mix of emotions we all share on graduation day. And quickly get off the stage so you can hear your graduate's name called. And in that spirit, I will be brief. But it took a moment, but I finally found the word for the class of 23. See, I took the advice of my grandmother and I cast my eyes on high and the words finally arrived. And today's word is, see it through. So turn to your neighbor and say, neighbor, see it through. see it through. See, this is also the point in the speech that I'm supposed to regale you with great words of wisdom and encouragement that will propel you to the next phase of your life. However, what will likely happen is you won't remember this speech. But YouTube will. So when you log in a decade from now, feeling nostalgic, we will be here to remind you of who you are. You will re be reminded of today's words of wisdom. See, one of my favorite poems is See It Through. It's one that I learned nearly 25 years ago while pledging the greatest fraternity in the universe, the bond known for uniting college men of culture, patriotism, and honor, while also achieving in every field of human endeavor. And the last stanza of that poem reads, even hope may seem but futile when troubles you're beset. But remember you are facing just what other men have met. You may fail, but fall still fighting. Don't give up whatever you do. Eyes front, head high to the finish. See it through. See, Hurricanes, there will be challenges ahead. You will face setbacks and disappointments. But don't let those setbacks define you. Instead, use them as opportunities to learn and grow. See, you have to use your setbacks as a setup and see it through. Surround yourself with supportive people who believe in you and your dreams. And most importantly, believe in yourself. Believe that you have what it takes to make a difference in the world, because you absolutely do. But when that confidence wavers, it's OK. See it through. See, Canes of 23, you're probably feeling a combination of excitement, pride, nervousness, joy, and maybe even a little sadness. But the greatest feeling you should have today is one of accomplishment. You have worked hard to reach this milestone, and you should be proud of yourselves for making it here. 
you should also have an even greater sense of pride because you are not only high school graduates, but you are a heritage high school graduate. And as you move on to the next chapter of your lives, remember that you are capable of achieving great things because you stand on the shoulders of the graduates of Carver, Huntington, and Ferguson High Schools, proudly representing the Southeast community of Newport News. You are the pride of the city. You are your ancestors' wildest dream. And for no other reason, forge ahead with determination, do it for them, if not for you. But either way, see it through. See, even hope may seem but futile when troubles you're beset. But remember, you are facing just what other men have met. You may fail, but fall still fighting. Don't give up whatever you do. Eyes front, held, head held high to the finish. Don't give up whatever you may do with every fiber of your being. Remember, you are a heritage hurricane. See it through. And with that, I bring you to the closing. But I will continue the tradition of giving you three final takeaways, AKA life hacks, to send you on your way. Number one, whatever must be done, must be done well. Number two, the brain has two functions, thinking and remembering. Most only remember, make sure you use yours to think. To think. And contrary to all the feedback I received for the last two years, it clearly needs to be said again. Number three, sugar still doesn't go on grits. And with that canes of 23, I bid you adieu. But before I go, just remember, as always, it's a great day. Before we begin the presentation of diplomas, I would like to remind the audience that it is important that each family hears the name of their graduate. We ask you to applaud the graduates with respect and refrain from extensive celebrations that will prevent students and families from hearing the next name as it is called. It is also important to note that this commencement exercise will be viewed by our servicemen and women who may be stationed around the world. The Heritage High School class of 2023 will now receive their diplomas as a visible symbol of their graduation from high school. We ask out of respect that you keep your name, your celebration to a minimum as we call each student's name. Will the first row of graduates please stand and proceed to the stage. We begin. We begin the awarding of diplomas by recognizing our fallen hurricane in the class of 2023. Kiron Dante Bowles. Kiron's mother, Miss Marquita Williams, father, Mr. Dante Bowles, and sister, Miss Dinesia Williams Bowles will come forward to receive his diploma.
Patrick, Tariq Ricks. Samuel Ayala Sanchez. Niaja Amani Jackson. Justin Thomas Addo. Tajay Atalin Atkins. Carlin Jackson Agent. Kayla Angel Allen. Shakayla, Latricia, Michelle, Austin. Jada, Danielle, Antoine. Isaiah, Benjamin, Armstrong. Madison, Taylor, Event. Maureen, Bianca, Baculanta. Aaron, Gerald, Bailey. Tanaya, Simone, Bandy. Olivia, Marie, Bornstead. Charlize, Marie, Barrett. Kanaya, Renita, Bats. Samara, Anissa, Bayonne. Javon, Davion, Beatty. William, James, Bennett. Janiah, Marie, Bethay. Marquay, Kendall, Bishop Ruff. Kamar, Lamont, Blow. Kisan, Ty Lee, Blue. Kaylin, J. Boston. Jada, Janae, Boyd. Relena, Princessa, Bracero. Eddie Bradley, Jr. Kayla Nicole Branch. Amira Amina Brown. Brianna Michelle Brown. Derek Brown. Abrielle Jache Buckley. Alice Shamara Burton. Jordan Tyler Buskell. Tiana Leanne Butcher. Brianna Alicia Bynum. Liana Saray Bird. Sanaya Yasnik Sakari Kabler. Jalen McKenzie Calicut. Estelle Paciencia Kamara. Jaron Marquise Campbell. Jacob Carter. Xavion Khalil Carter Davis. Samuel Joseph Caulfield. Taji Andrew Cook. 
Travion Zamor Cook, Nazir Montez Criddle, Marquise Michael Nazir Kroom, Christy Adrian Crowder, Hunter Thomas Dame. Jalen Namir Darden. Stephanie Aaliyah Davis. Taji Aleem Davis. Terrell Anthony Davis Jr. Amari Denise Deloach. Michael Joshua Dominguez. Jelani Emilio Douglas. Marshall Alexander Dozier. Michaela Star Dumas. Deja Miracle Eason. Dion Ibrante El Hare Bay. Jose Christopher Escobar. Jose Victor Fuentes Escobar. Kylie Ewart. Khalil Shaheem Finney. Amari Janique Fisher. Marquise Anthony Fleming. Kenneth De La Cruz Foley. Renisa Monique France. Russell Darnell France. Michaela Trevana Frazier. Nari Royal Frazier. Savion Jaden Frazier. Taquan Mayel Frank. Elijah Carol Fullwood. Monte Terrell Gary. Jordan Gabriel Gaston. Zaniah Takira Gatling. Anique Michelle Gales. Taberlin Carolyn Ann Green. Ramon Lionel Green. Cameron Roberts Gribble. Kaiden Alexandria Gines. Brianna Desiree Hall. Ajani Alexander Hammond. Deshaya Nicole Hargraves. Micaiah Eugene Harris. Nashawn Malachi Sicario Harris. Ariella, Aurelia Sharice Haskins. Shanice Simone Hales. Adrian Daniel Hernandez. Donnell Wayne Hewitt. 
Aaliyah Hines. Aaliyah Hines. Braylon Alexander Holden. Charles Gary Holly. Gracie Joe Holmes. Lola Lee Holmes. Zacchaeus Uriah Hopkins. Clayton Donald Houston. Kyle Lamont Hudgens. Elijah Isaiah Ingram. Makai Dominique Jeffries. Akiba O'Shea Johnson. Christopher Lee Johnson. Jeremy Lamont Johnson Jr. Kiera Yvonne Johnson. Nazela Ashanti Johnson. Deja Cora Johnson Outlaw. Jamika Nazaree Jones. Jalen Kwalik Jones. Yamir S. Jones. Nazavier Kellum. Robert David Kelly. Celeste Amis Kelly. Nazir Makai King. Laura Michaela Kinsey. Natalie Sydney Knight Shumpert. Jamie Nicole Langley. Micaiah Najay Lee Criddle. Samaya Lanika Lumsden. Shafiq Lumsden. Carlos Jason Lazon. Jalen Takori Manago. Camiana Michaela Martinez. I'm sorry. I'm Connor Andrew Mason. David Lewis Mason. Jeremiah Talid Maxwell. Imani Elizabeth McCallum. Christian Lamont McGlone. William Roland McKay. Jermaine Roderick McLaughlin. Malik Jalen McKenzie. Charlesia Ananil McLaren. Joshua James Dunn McLean. Edward Earl McMillan. Armani Sincere McSwain. Jacory Unique McSwain. 
Kyrie Marquise Medley Smith. Josephine Anna Marie Mitchell. Tori Armand Mitchell. Christopher Morales Luis. Jatai Duran Morris. Jadira Monet Marix. Ariana Marie Nicole Nichols. My bad, I didn't look her name up. Kareem Mayon Orange. Deontay Tashawn Parham. Kenya Amartrice Parker. Danielle O'Brien Payne. Jayori Amir Payne. Dominique Ray Peet. Anthony Andre Pendleton. Liza Perez Rodriguez. Galileo Perez Santos. Giovantes Deshaun Pitts. Freddie Allen Precarte. Kayla Michelle Pope. Janila Denise Porter. Javon Lamont Powell. Khalid Devante Powell. Nicholas Provigiano. Azariah Davion Pugh. Donovan Josiah Rakes. Emma D. Rainey. Juana Teresa Ramos. Kevin Giovanni Reyes Espinano. Tatiana Yvette Kimberly Rice. Imari Latrice Riddick. Soraya Lene Roberts. Sean Marquise Robertson. Adriel Giovanni Rodriguez. Ariel Destiny Rogers. Jolene Mercedes Rodan. Sanai Janae Salsby. Isaiah Randall Scott. Shelia Diane Cisse. Xavier Henry Selden. Casey Sellers. Diamond Denise Skitwith. Ariana Devine Smith. Caleb Leon Smith. Epiphany Star Smith. Keisha Maya Smith. Majane Patrice Solomon. Danielle Lorraine Stevens Scott. 
Angela Renee Sudbury. Timothy Ray Taylor. Anthony Vontrese Thomas. Joshua Montrese Thomas. Justine Marshall Thomas. Kiana Maesia Thomas. Miles Nelson Thomas. Sarah Laverne Thomas. Mukaya Nicole Thorpe. Jati Asia Tinsdale. Dayana Gabriela Torres Perez. Destin Damian Michael Townsend. Alexander Scott Turnsick. Kawaya Anna Cameron Tyson. Tatiana Renee Usher. Cherish Yvette Kimberly Van Cleef. Brian Christopher Vinicio. Kevin Jesse Vinicio. Now, Nigel Devin Waiters. Greer Demari Washington. Anaya Nari Watkins. Fania Sari Wellens. Taj Atlantis White. Tariq Deontay Whiting. Madison Faye White. Alexavier Demetrius Williams. Anthony Alexander Williams. Dewanye Amari Williams. Michaela Inez Williams. Nikita Ramel Williams. Sabria Kamora Wooden. Sanaa Examora Wooden. Sanaa Ziamora Wooden. Anaya Makai Wright. Will the class of 2023 now stand? By the authority vested in me as your principal, by the Commonwealth of Virginia, and by the School Board of Newport News, I certify that each one of you has successfully completed the course of study required for graduation. I 
I now declare you graduates of Heritage High School. You may move your tassels from right to left. Congratulations to the Heritage High School graduates of 2023. Mr. Brown, 